Hey everyone, I hope you're well. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, my name is Seppi, and in today's video, I'm bringing you guys along with me for another vlog. I'm just getting ready, so we're gonna have to walk and talk. Yes, I haven't made my bed, lol. I'm going to work now. I've just made a coffee, and I need to pour the milk in it, and I just thought, let me grab my vlog camera and bring you guys along. Today's outfit's super simple. This blazer is from, wait, I'll put the camera down and show you quickly. This blazer's from Forever 21. I got it when I was in sixth form when I was 16. Why is everything from my work outfits from sixth form? Um, this bodysuit is from Boohoo and these trousers, which are actually like flare at the bottom, they're so cute. I got from the Zara sale in Milan. If you guys have watched my Milan vlog from two years ago, you'll probably see these pants, which is quite jokes. I'm just making a latte. I have one of these chili mugs, so I pour it in here. And no, I didn't buy this myself. It belongs to one of my sisters who doesn't use it. Don't know which one because they just left it here and I take it every morning because it doesn't spill when I drive. Um, so yeah, let's grab our coffee to go and we are out of here. So guys, I am back home. What is this look, please? And I am in sporty gym gear. Um, no, I didn't work out. Did I plan to work out? Yes. Did I put on the clothes to work out? Yes. Did I work out? No. But look what I'm having. Salad Shirazi made by my mom. She is the best. And she's made me salmon as well. And I believe she's made me rice. Thank you. Yeah, so we've got the rice as well. Everything looks all over the place, but honestly, can't wait. If you guys know me well, then you know I'm gonna sit down, have this, and watch some Modern Family. And then in the evening, I'm going out with a new work friend of mine. Shout out, Amelia. Um, and I think she's bringing someone, and Sina might come with me too. I've had quite a nice day at work. Um, it's been really nice, and it's so nice to come home and it's still sunny and bright. Mum, have you said hi, by the way? Oh, hello, everybody. <laughs> Can I press the oh, please. Yeah, Mom, please. She is actually the best woman in the world. And this is the finished product. This is Mahi Polo Salmon and Rice with, oh my God, Salah Shirazi. I had a mind blank there for a second. <laughs> and every Iranian knows about the Polo Paz. This was mine from uni, but I never used it because I never learned how to make rice. So guys, I'm going to attempt an at-home workout. I hate these because I hate getting really hot and sweaty in my house and also my feet don't grip right on the carpet and I don't like doing it in the garden. I basically don't like at-home workouts so quarantine's been really hard for me. But um, gyms have reopened and hopefully by the end of the month I'm gonna find a gym that's close to my work and start going there. So that will be good. Um, but now I'm gonna do a Pamela Rafe one. She is on my screen right now. So yeah, I've got her on my screen right now and I'm gonna do a little bit of a workout. I'm 30 seconds into the workout and I'm like, what is this? And it's a dance workout, so I'm not doing that. I'm gonna have to find something else. I was like, why do I feel like such a weirdo doing this workout? So guys, I'm about to go get a facial done with Silk Cosmetics. I wanna read their Instagram. It's silk.cosmetics, that's their Instagram. But I will show you the process. Um, my skin is doing quite well, but it's really, really like oily, greasy. Um, in general, it's always been like, I have really like oily T-zone and like 
yeah i think it's good to like take care of your skin my skin really broke out the start this year if you guys were watching my vlogs you knew that was all i spoke about was how bad my skin was but i think like good weather and no stress has been helping it but i think it's still important to take care of it and go for facials so i'll share my experience with you guys for sure also how cute is this tracksuit you guys are gonna kill me for doing like selfie views but there is a photo of this on my instagram if you don't want selfie views so so i am here now and how pretty is it here so sweet <laughs> do you want to say hi <laughs> introduce yourself hi, i'm alice <laughs> um, i'm the like owner of sort of cosmetics and Seppi's coming today for the big day facial so we're really excited can't wait and guys make sure you check out their instagram as well because you're going to see like videos of it and you're going to see it on my insta too <laughs> I want to say look how nice my skin looks even under the night like it feels so nice that mask that we showed you is to die for I'm actually obsessed I think I'm gonna come back all the time just for the mask and if not for the mask then for Alice because she's so oh, sweet so honestly much. such a nice person and like she walks you through everything you're doing and like checks you're feeling okay and like she's just really sweet like honestly it's so nice to like come somewhere where you feel like really comfortable so thank you so much my thank lovely, you, lovely honestly. and honestly can't wait for my next facial because I already feel glowing look at that I'm gonna you're gonna have to kick me out of here at some point but honestly look how glowy even like in the video I'm looking it looks so glowing I mean so guys it is about six o'clock now I've finished work I'm in my trackies but today is a very special day because I just got paid um, so this is my first paycheck ever as a doctor. It's not my first paycheck ever because if you guys watch older videos about me, you'd know that I've had different jobs in the past. Um, and this isn't my first time like making money for myself, but this is my first time making money as a doctor and I'm so proud and I'm so happy. And I'm sure loads of guys, you guys will be curious to know like how much did you earn, etc. Um, which I'm not shy about revealing because i want to be open and transparent with you guys because i know so many of you guys come to me as like a source of what it's like to be a junior doctor because you guys are considering it or you're just curious or let's say you live in another country and you want to compare so um the basic starting salary of a junior doctor is approximately twenty eight and a half thousand pounds um and after like taxes deducted and stuff it's around the two thousand pound mark a month on your basic salary but of course when you work in hospital you earn on top of your basic salary because you do on calls weekends and nights which all pay differently and usually you probably stay not usually but it's often happens that you stay beyond the hours that you're meant to be working because the hospital might be busy you might be helping someone out you might have a really sick patient so it can fluctuate and even like go up by like even like ten thousand pounds like to thirty eight thousand i've heard some of my friends say on their contract so yeah it all is around that value so i hope that that sheds some light for you guys in terms of what the first thing i'm going to spend my paycheck on for myself is i'm actually going to donate some money to a charity my friend's dad is doing a charity cycle um and he's doing it for the cure which is for breast cancer i shared the link on my instagram and i know like it's really hard to share stuff on Instagram and like because there's so many donations and fundraising and stuff like it's hard to know like what to maybe you have a set amount of money that you can give to charity or whatever and you're hard for you to like split and like help everyone but like if any of you guys want to look into it I'll put the link down below um, but I want to kind of do something good with with the money that I've made because I remember uh, the first thing that I spent money on to be something that I feel really happy about and that's something that I want to do so uh yeah in case you guys were wondering how much i earned and what's the first thing i bought or spent money on it is a donation to the cure um well technically sponsoring someone doing a cycle ride through the italian alps in aid of the cure which is uh does in groundbreaking research for breast cancer so i hope that's interesting for you guys um i'm gonna get changed now and i think sina myself and my mom are gonna go to brent cross um, I initially didn't want to go 
um, because I wanted to do some editing. But I don't know, I'm in two minds. Maybe I won't go actually now, thinking about it, because I need to edit and I need to do some med medicine related stuff. I've got quite a big to-do list. I'll see, I'll keep you guys updated. Showing you guys what I got from Brent Cross. So I went to Mango and I got these pair of work trousers. Um, they're really nice. I don't know if you can see it in this light. The light in my room is honestly awful. But um, I'll try them on for you now, actually. I'll try them on. What's funny is, you guys can't see me change, but you can hear me change. They fit so nice. I tried them on in the store. I was really shocked that Mango's changing rooms were open. But it makes sense. I honestly don't understand why Zara's changing rooms aren't open. We're going to go home and try on those clothes anyway, Han, and then bring them back if they don't fit. So what's the point of having your changing room shut? I don't really understand. Probably because it's more effort for them to clean between each person, but still, a business is a business. Anyway, these are the trousers. They are so nice and soft, and I really, really like them. So don't mind what you see in the mirror. This is the clothes that I'm sorting out for my workwear. Um, I always try to organize it. It's Sunday, so I'm trying to organize it for the whole week, so I won't put it on the rack. But yeah, anyway, um, these are the pants. They are so nicely fitted. They're a size eight. I'm usually like a size like six or an eight. Um, the Zara pants, the work pants that I have, that I wear all the time. I'll actually show you because they're on here. These are a few of the Zara work trousers that I have. And these are all in size 8. And their weights are huge on me. Like, honestly, nothing fits like this. This mango size 8 one is really true to size and it was only £20. Um, these Zara ones I got on sale. They were originally £20. I got them down to £10 back in March or April. Um, so, yeah. They don't fit as well as these ones do. I need to get them tailored. But these fit like a glove i am obsessed so last night we went out to a family dinner to celebrate me getting paid i just want to take everyone for dinner if you guys want to see that dinner actually you should head over to Sina's channel because she vlogged that um but i'm obsessed with my work outfit today so i'm going to show you guys so, this is today's work outfit my jumper is from h&m it's Sina's, i think my shirt soul got me from top shop and it's actually really cute it's like this ruched material underneath, um, which I think is so sweet. And then I've got these mango pants. So guys, when I went to Brent Cross, these are the trousers that I bought. And then my shoes are Zara, but they're the uncomfortable ones that I told you about because I still haven't bought a comfortable pair of shoes. Um, thanks to my mum for holding the camera. Say good morning. She <laughs> <my shoe. laughs> Okay, I have to go because I'm running late. Let me just grab myself a coffee. Coffee, and we out of here, girl. It's the end of the day, and we are out of here. Um, I also feel really shy that someone's gonna see me with my camera because they're probably not used to doctors vlogging, but oh well. Really just got caught with my camera so awkward. Rocky say hi! Hello! Could we say hello? Say <laughs> hello! <laughs> uh, Rocky just wanted to make a quick entry and say hi to you guys. I have finished work, I edited and uploaded a video. You guys, well actually I'd already edited it so I just like made the thumbnail of and uploaded um, the new McDonald's mukbang vlog, which you guys absolutely seem to be enjoying, which I'm so happy about. Can I just say, filming a mukbang is hard, guys. Like, honestly, you, you can't like control yourself to stop eating. My mum is here. Oh, thank you. Mm, so, um, basically on my way home, I stopped and got my mum these flowers what do you think guys these are the flowers i got her they look cuter from like this angle yeah these are the flowers i got her i thought they're super cute and she deserves more than just no, flowers so you shouldn't so, do that man. nah but uh, you, i love you so much mm, i love you too so yeah guys mm -hmm. as you can guess this wouldn't be a sepida samai vlog 
without my mum making Zenish put up on more. <laughs> you guys, to be fair, I'll be honest with you. She hasn't made Zenish Pollen in a really long time. Nah, yes. I'll give you that. She hasn't made it in a really long time. Um, so I'm proud of you. Thank you. <laughs> You're proud of me because I didn't make Zenish Pollen. Yeah. <laughs> so that is the end of this video. I hope that you guys have enjoyed this vlog. If you did, then please make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe. It really goes a long way. I hope that you guys enjoyed learning a bit more about my junior doctor life. Any more questions you have or videos you want to see, let me know in the comments. Comments. Don't forget to check out my socials. They're always linked down below. My Instagram is Persian Bunny and my snap is Sepi Samai. Love you guys so much and I'll see you next time. Bye! Bye! <laughs> With my lovely flower my daughter, she goes for me. Thank you, baby. Love you.